Over the past few years of my life, I've strengthened my relationship with God through prayer. And there's something that has really helped me to do this, New Day. <laughs> I've been to New Day twice now, and both times I've come away more thoughtful about my faith. I'm so happy that I've given my life to Jesus, for this is the best decision I've ever made, and I know that God will always be there for me. Last year at New Day 22, I felt like Jesus was calling for me to get prayed for by the people at the front of the stage. And they prayed for me, for my journey in Christ. This was the first time I had felt the Holy Spirit's presence strongly. I want to be baptised today to declare my devotion and love for Jesus. Galatians 2 verse 20 says, I have been crucified with Christ and I no longer live, but Christ lives in me. The life I live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself for me. I've already given my life to Jesus and I want to show everyone that I love my God and I want to be a follower of Jesus. That day, when I gave my life to Jesus, little did I know that he would be the most important choice to make in my life. I'm so happy that I did. I can have peace knowing that whatever challenges I face, I can know that God is always there for me and they will never leave me. I would have panic attacks every day. I would throw up because of anxiety. I like craved a person that would always be there and never leave. And I decided that God would be that person as I heard he was for other people. And by last year, New Day, I was going through like a horrible depression and I almost didn't even go to New Day. But there, God made me realize I was idolizing other people and their opinions above his own. And I was obsessing over being seen as a perfection when in reality, such perfection can only be found in him. I don't have to be perfect in my friendships and no one's expecting that. My self-esteem has improved because the source of it is in God. Um, and I'm just thankful to God that I can find joy even in the midst of my anxiety because he's the source of my joy. And I serve a God that is beyond any anxiety or any mental health disorder I have. And he has revealed and upheld me, not as a child of anxiety, but his child clothed in righteousness. I would be nowhere if not for his grace. And I'm ready to see where he takes me. <laughs>